Welcome back. This is the second video in your LiveScribe Echo Smart Pen training series. In this video, we will cover more in-depth features like shortcuts and launch line to help you take full advantage of your DPRC issued Smart Pen. SmartPen is a powerful note-taking aid. By recording your lectures, it allows you to focus on your class rather than your notes. When you are taking your notes, don't worry about writing everything down at once. Just focus on key concepts during the lecture. You can come back later to replay your lecture and take more detailed notes. Just focus on key concepts during the lecture. You can come back later to replay your lecture and take more detailed notes. At the SF State DPRC, we recommend you use the Cornell note-taking system with your smart pen. Using the Cornell system, you will divide your note page into three columns, a question column, a note-taking column, and a summary column. During your lecture, you will activate the pen's recording feature and write down your notes in the notes column. When the class is over, you will replay your notes and summarize any additional information you feel is important in the summary column. If you have additional questions or you don't understand a topic, you can use the question column. Revisit your notes before an exam and write down any additional insights you discover. Great! If you want to learn more about the Cornell system combined with a smart pen, check out the link below the video. Now, let's take a deeper dive into some of the more advanced features of your smart pen. In order to record your lectures, your smart pen contains a built-in microphone. Normally, to activate the microphone, you would press the record button inside your notebook. However, you can also quickly activate audio recording by simply holding down the power button until the audio recording activates. This is especially convenient if you want to use your smart pen as an audio recording device and don't plan on writing any notes. To get the most out of your smart pen, you will need to be able to navigate the menu. On the last page of your notebook, you will find the smart pen controls. The most important controls are provided, like volume control. By accessing the main menu, you can navigate through the settings and features of your smart pen. We will not be covering every feature of the pen, but knowledge of the menu features can be very helpful, such as the built-in calculator and sound stickers. You can navigate the menu going up, down, left, and right. Tapping right is always used to select the setting. For left-handed users, the ability to flip the display is found in the menu. Click Menu, then click Down button until you reach Settings. Click the Right button and continue clicking the Down button until you reach Display Orientation. Click Right again, you will see Right-handed. Click Down, the menu will display Left-handed. Click Right to select. Before we move on, let's make sure to set the date and time. Your notebook provides a specific interface for this purpose. Simply tap Set Date to begin. Use the number pad and enter the month, date, and year. Likewise, to set the time, tap on the Time button. Take some time to click through and explore the menu. In order to make it more convenient for you to access frequently needed information about the pen, like the battery level or storage space, your notebook includes three shortcut buttons located at the top corners of the page. You may assign any open paper smart pen app or a quick command to a shortcut button. For instance, if you would like an easy way to check the battery remaining, click and hold the pen on the shortcut button of your choice. The pen will chirp and ask you to write an application name or command. Write the word battery anywhere on the page. 
Now click on the shortcut button. The pen will display the battery remaining. Try it again with shortcut 2 and set it to the pen's remaining storage. The smart pen's ability to replay audio when you click on a note you've written in your notebook is called paper replay. Let's demonstrate by taking some notes about the basics of organizational management. To begin, tap the record button. Management is the process by which human efforts are coordinated and combined with other resources to accomplish organizational goals and objectives. Mary Parker Follett defines management as... By recording your lectures, the smart pen allows you to focus on what is happening in your class rather than focusing on taking notes. Using the Cornell note-taking method, write the lecture concepts in your own words. Stay simple and high level if possible. You can come back later and replay the audio recording to find key concepts and insights. Management is the process by which human efforts are coordinated and combined with other resources to accomplish organizational goals and Write objectives. any insights or questions about the content in the question section after replaying your notes. Your pen stores all your recordings individually under the paper replay section of the menu. To access them, click on the menu, then click down until you find paper replay. Click right and then click down until you find play session. Click right. Scrolling through, you will find a list of all the sessions currently stored on the pen organized by date. Click right to play a session. Just focus on key concepts during the lecture. You can come back later to replay your lecture and take more detailed notes. You may also delete a session. This could be useful if you accidentally left your pen recording and want to free up the storage space. Similarly, find the session you want to delete and tap right to delete the session. If you accidentally click record and don't want to keep the session, you may quickly delete the unwanted session by simply pressing and holding the pen on the stop button for approximately five seconds. Once the pen detects your intention, it will ask you to confirm by clicking the stop button again. Paper replay is what makes a smart pen smart. Let's continue our management lecture. Tap the record button. Top level management includes individuals and teams that are responsible for making the primary decisions within a company. Shareholders, As you continue to use your smart pen in a variety of situations, you may want to customize some settings to suit your environment. Remember, the microphone in the smart pen is small and may not always pick up high quality recordings, especially if you are far away from the lecturer. Top level management includes individuals and teams that are responsible for making the primary decisions within a company. Personnel considered to be part of the company's top level management are at the top of the corporate ladder and members are imbued with powers given by the company's shareholders or board of directors. Two useful settings of the pen that can improve audio quality are microphone sensitivity and playback latency. If you're in a large room with poor acoustics or recording more complex audio like music, you may want to increase the recording quality. To quickly access smart pen settings, you can use a feature called Launch Line. To activate Launch Line, draw a short line to the right, then reverse directly over that same line to the left. The pen will activate Launch Line. Write Settings right above the line you just drew. The pen will interpret your handwriting and open the settings menu. To the top, bottom, left, and right of the line you just drew will be the navigation arrows. When you tap the pen within these zones, you will navigate the menu in the corresponding direction. Click on the written command, in this case, settings, to activate launch line. You'll see the option recording quality. Click on the right side to select it. There are three recording quality settings, low, medium, and high. Set the quality to high. Please remember that higher quality audio takes more storage space. If you're in a quiet setting, you can use lower quality audio. You can also set the microphone sensitivity. This sets the microphone to record in a small confined space or in a large open space, like a lecture hall. Now that you have set your pen to record high quality, 
Next time you record a lecture, you will play back in higher quality. Let's continue our management lecture. Tap the record button. A middle manager is a link between the senior management and the lower junior levels of the organization. Due to involvement into day-to-day -day running of a business, middle managers While taking notes, there will usually be a delay between when you hear something important and when you get a chance to write down a note. This can make it difficult to find a key word or phrase used in a lecture. Due to involvement into day-to-day -day running of a business, middle managers have the opportunity to report valuable information and suggestions from inside an organization. The smart pen can take this into account and comes with a setting called playback latency. If you set playback latency to on, the smart pen will always play back audio recorded five seconds before you started writing your note. To activate playback latency, go to the settings. Scroll down until you see playback latency. Click right, click up, then click right again. Now, when you play back your recordings, you'll hear them played from five seconds earlier. The lower level management consists of the foreman and the supervisors. They are selected by the middle level management. It is also called operative supervisory level of first line of management. Lower management We recommend you simply leave playback latency on. There will almost always be a small delay between when you hear something noteworthy and when you are able to write it down. Leaving playback latency on will make playing back your notes less confusing. The Echo Smart Pen is a fantastic note-taking tool. I hope this video was enough to get you feeling comfortable using your Smart Pen. Remember, the DPRC also offers one-on-one -on -one training, so if you feel you need additional support, please just ask. We've also included some useful links at the bottom of the video. In our next video, we will show you how to plug your pen into your computer to download, organize, and share your notes. See you soon.